The most famous Brazilian track in history is in English. Quite naturally, right? He made enough success to break through the national boundaries. That's the track that won the Grammy in 1965. Take that, Beatles. This is also the second most recorded track of all time, according to some, behind Yesterday by the Beatles. Anyway, this video is about this track, Garota de Ipanema, or The Girl from Ipanema. Particularly, it's about how the translation to English absolutely murdered this track forever. Well, maybe it's not that extreme, but at the very least, it's an interesting shift. Find below three lyrics for this track. The original in Portuguese, the literal translation, and the official translation. The source for the literal translation is me. I am a native Portuguese speaker. Feel free to hold me against my English, of course, but my Portuguese is supposed to be pretty good. Okay, first thing. It's incredibly difficult to translate things and keep it aligned with the original idea. It was even difficult to make the literal translation truthful. I still needed a bit of a wiggle to make it fit. Look where I used the parenthesis there, and you see that. I mean, translations are very subjective processes. I'm sure you appreciate it goes deeper than simply translating word by word. Most things don't even fit if you do it like that, and it gets 10 times more tricky when you're talking about figures of speech. For instance, Moça do Corpo Dourado, translated literally would be Girl of the Golden Body. This is an analogy for being tanned, of course, but it just sounds like it was translated by a computer. What comes after is also funny. The second do here works as a possessive element, like of the, but also as a consequence, like because of. Before we get too confused here, a literal translation of that sentence would be girl of the golden body of the Ipanema sun, which is not exactly conveying the poetic essence of what's being said. So it's understandable that translations will always be a bit different from the original. There was a lot of subjectivity, even in my short translation, and I have no problem with that at all. Wiggling around to fit or omitting or adding the odd word to make it more coherent is absolutely fine. My problem is a change of meaning that happened with this translation. In green, everything that has been added that is actually not in the original. It's even in my literal translation, look, I had to to make it more truthful to the original meaning, but I haven't distorted anything at least. First thing is, while we understand the standard of beauty was being tall and young, this is never seen in the original. There is no characteristic attached to the girl other than being beautiful, graceful, and tanned. Even describing her as young is debatable. Menina can imply that, but the association with age is not as straightforward. It could be anywhere between zero to mid to late twenties, really. And the next word they use is moça, which has the same problem. It could be anywhere between maybe tens to thirties. No one ever goes ah oh, in the context, and the original is far more poetic. It says the word smiling fills up with grace, if you're looking for anything closer to this. She swings, but it's not like a samba in the original. She's also not gentle. I mean, maybe she is, but it's not written down, you know? Yeah, but maybe all of these are a bit minor, aren't they? Like, what have they actually changed? I mean, but just wait until you get to the third verse. There are a few fundamental problems with meaning here. Number one, the person singing the song has been transformed into a narrator, meaning it changes from the first person to third person. The original person in the song sings about the girl himself, whilst the one in the translation is telling a tale about two other people he's watching. Number two, the guy watching the girl has become a loner who is desperate for her love, when this is not in the original at all. Number three, the fundamental meaning of the track changes from something positive, like when the girl passes the word fills up with grace, to something negative, the guy dreading the fact he does not have the girl. There is a downer moment in the original to be fair, but it's more like of a contemplative moment about life. And the girl is actually the agent that takes him out of the bad trip in the end. In the translation, she directly causes the bad trip and there is no conflict resolution at all, like the fourth verse does in the original. Instead, they just go back to the first verse and repeat it. I mean, I made a less grumpy version in yellow for all the actually changed meaning without being too picky. As we discussed, Stahl is giving her a characteristic that she definitely didn't have before. I'll give young a pass and gently and lovely as well. If you stretch grasa and use a bit of your imagination, that could work. I can give each one she passes go ah a pass as well in terms of meaning if you consider the last verse of the original, the word smiling fills up with grace. It's just in bad taste, that's all. It's difficult to give a pass to like a samba, but I understand this was trying to introduce the rhythm to a new audience and to appeal to the novelty of it, so that's kind of understandable, you know? But it's impossible to give a pass to the third verse and to his smiles but she doesn't see, which is just playing to that depressed boy plot. So if you're picky, it's this. If you're generous, it's this. But in either scenario, the bulk of the meaning has been irreversibly changed by that third verse. Wonder why they did that? Who translated this? What's the context? Well, keep tuned. 
I can't give everything away, you know, I need to hold you to have more clicks and that kind of thing. In the meantime, if you want to check Instagram, subscribe to the channel. Um, there's a lot of Brazilian music recommendations we do that can actually make your life brighter and your days more filled with novelty. So you can check the playlist in Spotify. You can even check a, like a spreadsheet we've done with that that actually gives you details of the track so you can like go to the ones you're more interested into. If you don't want to do anything as well, it's fine. 